What's going on gamers? Today we are going to go over how to install and use the chess sort plugin in Minecraft. Before we get started, don't forget to like, subscribe, and click that notification bell to stay up to date on all future videos. When I'm playing Minecraft, I'm going to be honest, making my items look nice isn't necessarily the first thing on my mind. As you know, there is a ton of junk in game that fills up chests and not organizing can become a big problem, since sorting through all of your chests to find what you're looking for is time consuming. This is all changing with the chest sort plugin, a plugin that allows all players to instantly sort their chests, barrels, and even their own inventories with the press of a button. This plugin is also highly customizable with its many settings and options to change, so let's go over how to install and start using Chess Sort. Head towards Chess Sort on Spigot and press download now. Save the file somewhere like a separate folder, and then head right over towards your Apex server panel. Stop the server, and once it is completely offline, click FTP file access near the top left and log in. Enter into the plugins folder and then press upload in the top left corner of the next page and drag and drop the plugin file into the upload area and wait for it to reach 100%. Once that's done, you can click on your server name at the top of the page to return to the main panel where you can restart the server. Next, go ahead and join your server and use the forward slash plugins command in chat to confirm if it was installed correctly. You will be looking for a green chest sort message. Now that you've installed the plugin, it's time to use it. The ability to sort and organize items in your chests and other containers is probably the main reason that you chose this plugin. No matter what material, block, or item you have in your inventory, this plugin will instantly organize them. There are a few different ways of doing this, which is mainly done through hotkeys. No matter which one you choose, these will all be the main features that you'll use to make use of this plugin. Here is a list of hotkeys to try in-game. This list will also be available in our written guide that will be linked down below. These hotkeys are the main ones for players to use by default without needing specific permissions, but there are also other ones that can be configured if you want. The best way to customize chest sort is actually through its settings menu, allowing you to fully control the hotkeys and automatic systems. For example, if you don't want to worry about manually organizing your chests, then you're going to want to enable the automatic sorting option in the GUI. That being said, before making any changes, you'll have to actually become a server operator and use the forward slash sort command in game chat. This is what's going to allow you to open the menu and begin editing the settings in the GUI. There are other options to explore too, like toggling hotkeys and instantly emptying a chest with a specific material. As for chest sort commands, there actually aren't too many and most of them perform the exact same functions. Regardless, here is a list of some that you can go over. Keep in mind that you will have to be either a server operator or have specific permissions using a plugin like luckperms in order to use them. If you're wanting even more control over this plugin, then you can edit the configuration in the server files. It does about the same thing as the GUI menu, but there are about 700 lines of code, mainly filled up with any additional information about the settings, which you can go over if you want to fully understand all of the ways this plugin can be used. To customize this file, you're going to head back into your Apex panel and log in to the FTP file access and then enter into the plugins directory and click on the chest sort folder. Find the config YML file and then press edit to the far right. And here you can start changing settings and values to your wants. And once you are done, you can press save at the top. After pressing save, you can go back into your server and use the forward slash sort reload command to save any changes. If the plugin isn't working, first use the plugins command to confirm if you see chest sort in green. If the color is red or if you see nothing, then try and reinstall the plugin. Make sure you're using a paper or spigot server and that the version is compatible. 
This is truly one of the most helpful plugins I've ever come across, and I know I'm not the only one that thinks that it should honestly just be a permanent part of the vanilla game. With not having to focus on finding ways to organize or just taking the time to do that, you can focus on so much more and you'll always know exactly where to find all of your items. That's all for this one, gamers. As always, I hope you have lots of fun. Thanks for watching. If you want to see more great content like this, then subscribe or click these videos. Until next time, gamers.